I'll now show you how to email a lesson in Swing Catalyst. First, let's set up the email account that will be used to send out lessons to your students. Go to Settings in the Startup menu, click General, and find the Email Sharing Settings. Then type in a valid email address with the corresponding password. If you prefer to set up a new email account for this purpose, I suggest you go to gmail.com and sign up for a free Gmail account. When you have typed in your preferred email address and the corresponding password, click on the Test button to make sure you haven't misspelled either the email address or the password. Your outgoing email is now stored, and it's not necessary to type in your password next time you start up Swing Catalyst. You're now ready to email your first lesson. This is the same lesson that we recorded in the previous video tutorial. To email the video file directly to your student, click Share by Email. If you have registered an email address in your student's profile, it should automatically show up. If you haven't, you need to type in his or her email address. You can also edit the subject and add some comments before you send the email. Please notice that a one-minute lesson is approximately 12 megabytes. If you wish to record longer lessons, I suggest you use our YouTube feature. I will explain how to upload lessons to YouTube and share them via email or Facebook in the next video tutorial.